Can you get my sidearm out just in case? Because we got a guy standing right over a dead body. I'm gonna go try and speak with the guy. Oh! Oh man, he just got hit by the train! Get on the ground, get on the ground. Oh shit! Damn, he pulled a gun on me. Pit. Oh crap. Oh jeez. Let's just tap this guy right there. Get in the car. Get in the car. Okay. Uh, thank you, bulletproof windows. Get down on the ground. Welcome to Mike Golden Games and welcome back to LSPDFR. In this episode, we're going to be doing a Sheriff Detective Patrol in this Dodge Charger generally. I have not done a patrol in this vehicle before. I've done a patrol in this specific vehicle, but not with this skin on it. This looks like the General Lee. Uh, the red stripe on it, I don't know if that's screen accurate. I don't remember that stripe being on the car. But anyways, we do have the General Lee with the Confederate flag. Anyways, let's get right on patrol here. Hope you guys will enjoy this episode. And let's just get inside here, do a quick first person view of the car. I do like showcasing off the cars. Because this mod is really well done. And it sounds great too. Let's uh, put it in neutral here. Oh. Oh man, these, these this car is freaking beautiful. Look at that. Alright, so anyways, let's get on patrol here. I forgot to get my vest. Let's put that on under my shirt really quick here. In the Sandy Shore area, citizens reporting. Looks like we have reports of an MVA. Okay, Roger that. Uh, it's actually right down the block from me. Okay, we'll get over this way. Dispatch. Uh, okay, we have two vehicles that are flipped upside down. Got a pickup truck on top of another vehicle. Let's pull off to the side here. Hello, is everybody all right? I'm with the Sheriff's Department. Oh, hey, sir, I'm with the Sheriff's Department. Are you all right? Hey, man, you doing all right? Their car is a piece of shit. If anything, I did them a favor. Okay, um, get your ID on you, man. You can stop right there. LSPD, don't make me shoot ya! I noticed the odor of alcohol. Okay, okay, you got your ID on you. Uh, also, dispatch, let's get EMS to the scene. Uh, Marina Drive and Mountain View Drive. His name is Ronald Whitefield, born 12 11, 1969. Uh, dispatch, can I get a pet check on this guy? Again, Ronald Whitefield, born 12 11, 1969. License is valid, no active warrants. Okay, uh, let's have you come over this way, if you will, man. Sir, you want to you want to step over this way for me? And All right, I, I need to do a breathalyzer test on you. I, I didn't want you in the middle of the road, but I'll just run it right here. That's fine. This is dispatch. No further units required. Proceed with patrol. If you can blow into it right there, yep. Just keep blowing. Keep blowing. Uh, point one three six. Okay, I'm gonna need you to place your hands behind your back. You are way over the limit, man. All right, there we go. Okay, Ronald, come over this way. Let's get you out of the street now. I'm gonna have you sit down right over here. Uh, before I have you sit down, you got anything illegal on you? Face me, man, face me. You got anything illegal on you? Anything that's sharp that's gonna stab me, poke me, or stick me? You're, you're just gonna stare me down? You, you don't wanna say anything to me, really? You are that drunk, huh? Okay, just stand still, I'm gonna search you now. Okay, let's see if he's got anything on him. He does not have anything. Okay, Ronald, sit down, man. Okay, uh, looks like EMS was able to revive the driver of the vehicle, of the pickup truck, and the passenger. Man, she really hit her face bad. Hey, ma'am, are you all right? Are you able to speak with me? I noticed the odor of narcotics on her. Uh, you have your ID on you, ma'am? Nice driving! Uh, Mary Smoke. All right, Mary, hang in there for a second. Dispatch, I need a pet check on a Mary Smoke, born 5-13-1952. Less than valid, no divorce. Okay, I noticed the odor of narcotics on you. I'm just going to run a drug test on you really quick. Uh, we are going to have you go down to the hospital because you got hit pretty bad, but just because I do smell it on you, I need to record that. So if you could just blow into this here, yes, it's a drug -elizer test. Would you keep blowing in it there? Thank you. Positive for cannabis and cocaine. Cannabis is fine in California. Cocaine, not, 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 no. It, it's not at all, okay. All right, so we're gonna 
have her go down to the hospital. Okay, she has been drinking a lot. We'll ignore that, though. Let's get a uh, ambulance for the woman here, and then a transport unit's gonna come down for this guy. So, dispatch, I need transport unit down here. Both vehicles are gonna need to get towed. The car on the right that's upside down, that is gonna get impounded. The one on the right, uh, I don't know what's going on with the driver, so actually that's gonna go down to the impound as well. Because she has drugs in her system. I was gonna have it towed to their house. I'm not gonna do that. It's gonna go straight to the impound. All right, so this guy's getting in the back of that squad car now. Uh, she's gonna be getting in the back of that squad car. And then we got one tow truck there for that vehicle. And I believe we should have another tow truck for that vehicle. All right, so it looks like we are all cleared up, so we're going to get back on, on patrol. Hope you guys are enjoying the episode so far. If you are, hit that like button. That really helps me out when you do that. And if you have any suggestions for other types of patrols you want to see, let me know down in the comments below. Okay, it looks like we have reports of a dead body. Uh, dispatch Roger, that I'll be responding to that now. I'm heading north. Um, actually heading, yeah. I'm heading east on Marina Drive. I'm about a quarter mile from the location. I'll be there shortly. Uh, notify first responders. I'm almost there. So let's get up here. Gonna have to stop at the stop sign. There's actually no stop sign there. That's weird. Okay, come on, buddy. Let's go. And gonna brake torque it. There we go. Ooh, look at that burnout. Yeah. All right, so it looks like they're right here. Okay, there's a guy standing right there going to pull off to the side of the road here. Uh, dispatch, let's get an additional unit here, code 3. We've got a code 99. Let's get out here. Sandy Shores. Gonna get my sidearm out just in case, because we got a guy standing right over a dead body. I'm gonna go try and speak with the guy. Oh! Oh, man, he just got hit by the train! Sir, are you alright? Oh, man. Dispatch, we're gonna need EMS down here. The person that was standing over the dead body just got hit by the train. He didn't try to run. He just was standing too close to the tracks. And he got knocked out. Uh, hopefully he's only knocked out and not dead. Uh, I'm going to put my weapon away. Let's see. Can I search him? I don't think I can. But let's see. Nope. Nope. I'm trying to search that officer. Forget it. Officer, you're good. <laughs> I liked how she was holding her weapon up in the air. Uh, so, yeah. That's not good. Maybe that's what happened to her. Maybe she got hit by a train, too. All right, so EMS is arriving on scene now. Hopefully, they'll be able to revive both of them. You piece of crap. Hey, EMS, how's it going, guys? Right over here, we got two down. One female, one male. Female unknown of what happened. The male just got hit by the train. It looks like he just got clipped by it, so maybe he's just unconscious. Check him out, see if he's all right. You bet. Oh, yes. Okay, cool. So that guy was hit by the train. He was clipped by it, and it knocked him out. He's alive, so that's good. And then it looks like they were able to revive her as well. Uh, we still have unknown causes of what happened to her, but both of them were able to get revived, so we we're able to save both people. Nice. All right, sweet. Let's get back on patrol. Man, this car is such a beautiful-looking car, and I love how the headlights actually pop down, too. So if you go in here and turn the headlights on, there we go, look at that. Ooh, that is beautiful. And then you just turn them off and they go right back up. Uh, all units, you can clear this call. We all right, so control. Carlos was hit by a vehicle. That's what hurt him. And Julia was caused from falling. Was she like on the train and tried to jump off? I'm guessing that's what happened because they said it was fall injury. So whoa, 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 whoa. Damn it! And whoa! Can you guys stop? Okay. Really? Wow. What was that all about? Okay, I'm just gonna follow them. I'm not gonna pull them over. I'm just gonna follow them this way. Uh, potential deal going on. Uh, it's in front of us. Okay. So I guess we'll go this way. I love how this car handles too. It feels pretty realistic. Ooh, got a nice air on that one. And let's get up here. We'll pull around to the back right here because we don't want to blow our cover. So I'm just going to park right up here. Man, this General Lee looks freaking beautiful. I'm going to get my sidearm out 
And let's get up here. Whoop, making a little bit of noise. Okay, I don't see anybody there. So let's try to sneak around this way. Get behind this trailer. Uh, I don't see anybody. Let's get around this way. Let's see. I don't see anybody yet. Let's see. Let's get up here. Oh, right there. I see him. Okay. Dispatch, I have a visual on the suspect. I'm going to keep eyes on him, Code 5. All right, dispatch, I have a visual on a possible buyer. I'll move in on the arrest once I see the payment. She's going to hide out in the bushes here. Whoa, 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 she's got a gun. Drop the weapon, drop the weapon. Ah, shots fired, shots fired. Shoot. Both of you, drop the weapon, Sheriff's Department. Okay, I'm just going to let him deal with her. Sir, drop the weapon, this is the Sheriff's Department. Dispatch, any additional units got shots fired. Sir, drop the weapon now! Nope, that's not good. Dang it. I just spawned the car meet by mistake. Uh, this guy's gonna have a lot of backup in a second. Holy crap! I am getting out of here. There's like freaking 30 guys with guns. We got a lot of units moving up too. Oh, uh, this is not good. Uh, let's get the heck out of here get in my car. It is super laggy as well. My bad, guys. I messed that up. Let's get the heck out of here. I'm gonna have to do something about that drag me. Uh, looks like we have a Metro bus disturbance. Respond code 2. Roger that dispatch. We're gonna take a left here, even though our GPS is routing us another direction, but I know some back roads that'll let us get over there quicker. Uh, let's get around this way. And we're going to respond code 2. It's what the uh, dispatch told us to do. So This is the dirt road I was talking about. It's going to cut our time probably in half or so. It's going to get us there a lot quicker. So we're just going to use this dirt path, and it's going to take us to the freeway. And then we just got to go up the freeway eh, maybe like 30 seconds or so. And then we're able to get off on the exit we need to be on. So let's take a left up here. Stop right there. And let's come on, go, 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 go. There we go. And we're gonna gun it. Oh man, this car is freaking sexy. Let's take a left and ride the shoulder. It's all right, we can do this, we're a detective. And let's see, we need to take a the next right uh, once we get past this silo up here. Whoa, oh! Okay, that state unit just hit us. Was that a sheriff? What was that? Okay. Really, really, officer, what was that all about? Jeez. Okay, we're going to take a left or a right up here. Let's see, our turn signals do work, so that's good. I believe this officer is going to be responding to the call with us. Uh, nope, never mind. He's going after somebody else. All right, so let's get up this road here. Ooh, this car is freaking sexy. Ooh, listen to that. Mm, that sounds so good. Uh, dispatch, we're going to be arriving on scene shortly. We're just over a quarter mile from the location. I have additional units on standby just in case we need backup. Uh, let's see, they're right up here somewhere. Uh, dispatch, I have a visual on the bus. Okay, they're blocking the road. I'm going to stop right here. Handle the scene. There may be some people you can talk to. Roger that. Just going to block the road, make sure everybody is safe. Hey, guys, I'm with the Sheriff's Department. What's going on? Whoa, whoa. dude, what's going on, man? Sir, calm down. What's going on? Let's see. Press Y to engage in conversation. Hey, what seems to be the issue, man? None of these people will have a conversation with me. All right, and... So why are you being disruptive? It's hard to control my temper. All right, you know, there's classes for that that you can attend. Is there anything else I could do for you? Sorry about this, officer. Oh, okay, man, just, just calm down, all right? It's fine. 
Maybe have a glass of water, you know, just take deep breaths. It, it really does calm you down when you do that, you know? In through the nose, out through the mouth. It really does calm you down pretty quick. All right, uh, is everybody all right then? Uh, okay, I'm gonna get your ID really quick, okay? Just gonna make sure everybody's checking out here. All right, so you get your ID on you, man? All right, thank you, Lewis Johnson. Uh, let me get a pet check on this guy. Dispatch, I need a pet check on a Lewis Johnson, born 11-17-1957. License is valid, no active warrant. All right, so I'm gonna get this guy off with a warning because I didn't see him do anything. He was in a fight stance, but I'm gonna let that slide because he didn't actually hit anybody. So, all right, man, I'm gonna give you a warning, okay? All right. So next time, just go. calm down. You don't need to fight anybody, okay? Uh, does anybody else want to talk? Let's see if I can speak with this guy. Nope. Uh, anybody else want to talk? Can you explain what happened, sir? I wasn't fully paying attention. Okay. So this guy that's directly behind our suspect didn't see anything. Uh, can I speak to anybody else? No. How about you, sir? Do you see what happened? All right, so it doesn't look like anybody else wants to speak to me. So I am going to say we are code four dispatch. All right, so we're gonna get back out on patrol then. Looks like we're clear. Uh, let's back up this way, and we will get back out on the road. We have a wanted felon on the loose. A wanted um, felon. Desert. Suspect is on foot. Suspect's on foot. A female, Jolie Seuss, for armed bank robbery. Okay, we're definitely going to need backup on this one. Roger that, dispatch. I'm heading north on Chansky Passage. I'm about a mile and a half from the location. Oh boy, there was a train right there. Oh, that was a close one. All right, let's slow it down. And we'll take a left up here. Okay, let's get over this way. Ooh, do a nice burnout. And get over these tracks. Make a complete stop. And let's get up here. And we're going to go straight as soon as traffic opens up. And this would be a real pain in real life. Because you got all these lanes of traffic. Alright, so I'm just going to pull up. I'm with the Sheriff's Department, ma'am. Okay, you're going to hit me like that? Really? Ma'am, stop right there. I'm with the Sheriff's Department. Stop. Okay. No, no, no. Get down on the ground, ma'am. On the ground right now. I'm with the Sheriff's Department. Okay, I'm gonna, ow, bitch, what are you doing? Get on the ground right now before you get tased. On the ground right now before you get tased. Let's go, down on the ground. Dispatch, I'm gonna need additional units over here. Get on the ground right now, dude. Dude, what are you doing? All right, let's get her in cuffs. Sir, back away, I'm with the Sheriff's Department. Dispatch, we have a Christabel Anderson in custody. Uh, let's get her name, or her ID really quick. Uh, Christopher Anderson, born 12, 27, 1987. License valid, negative warrants. Okay, Christabel, you got anything illegal on you? Anything that's sharp that's gonna stab me, poke me, or stick me? Nope. Okay, I'm gonna search you now. Just stand still. A monkey wrench nunchucks. That's illegal in the state of California. Okay, man. Um, let's have you get over this way. I'm gonna call a transport unit for her. And then we're gonna have to search her vehicle as well. Yikes. This is a big traffic pile up. Ooh, that's not good. Alright, cool. So we got an officer over here to pick her up. We're gonna search her vehicle really quick. Don't hit me, dude. Thank you. And let's get this thing searched as quick as possible, and then we'll get it towed away. Okay, piece of steel toes, pair of gloves, bottle of morphine, painkillers, a note written in foreign language, butterax t-shirt, a crowbar, and nothing of interest. Okay. Dispatch, I'm going to need a tow truck down to U.S. Route 13 and East Joshua Road. And we're going to get back into General Lee. Uh, where's my hat? Officer, hold on, wait. My hat's under your car. All right, guys, so we are on our way now. We're about half a mile from the suspect's location. 
gonna need to try and get up there as quick as we can because we did get delayed by that traffic collision back there. Now uh, we're just gonna ride the shoulder, no problem. And we do have a gas station somewhere up here. Uh, gonna flip around this way and take another left. Oof, this car drifts really well too. I just bet we're coming up on the location. I see the suspect in my sight. Let's get a little closer here. And I'm gonna stop right here. Get my taser. Uh, I'll get my firearm out because she does have a warrant. Ma'am, I'm with the sheriff's department. Can you stop right there, ma'am? Ma'am, can you stop right there? I'm with the sheriff's department. I need to speak with you. Yeah, hi. You got your ID on you, ma'am? Can I see your ID? Thank you, Julie Seuss. All right, I'm going to need you to place your hands behind your back for me, all right? All right, just hang in there. You're being placed under arrest. You do have an arrest warrant. Uh, did you know about that? You didn't know about that? Mm, um, that's what they all say. All right, do you have anything illegal on you, ma'am? Anything that's sharp that's going to stab me, poke me, or stick me? I really don't want to get poked by anything today. No, you don't? Okay, thank you for uh, saying that. I'm going to search you now, so just stand still. A uh, cigar and a bottle of morphine. Okay, so I found the bottle, but I didn't find a needle, so she was right. She didn't have anything that was going to stab me, so that's good. Uh, what do we got going on over here? Is everybody all right? There's a blip on my map, but I'm going to ignore that. Uh, dispatch, I got the suspect in custody. I'm going to need a transport unit down here, though. Backup required for uh, U.S. Route 13, Grand Sonora Desert. Grande Sonora Desert. Uh, thank you, Dispatch. And this car is freaking beautiful looking. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this episode. Again, if you do enjoy the episode, hit that like button. It really helps me out when you do that. All right, it sounds like we have an officer coming up here. Hey, officer, right here. Hello. Hey, officer, how's it going, ma'am? Having a pretty good day? Yeah, me too. I got this felon right here. Keep an eye on her. She was cooperative, though, so that's good. She didn't put up any kind of fight. All right, so let's get back on patrol. Let's get back in our charger, and we'll head back closer into town now. Oof, man, this car's beautiful. Let's go in first person really quick, just to see again. Look at this. This car is beautiful looking. I do like how it has a pretty realistic suspension as well. You know, look at that. I mean, oof. I kind of feel like I'm playing Forza right now. Speaking of which, I am gonna be, oh! I am gonna be getting Forza Horizon 4. I pre-ordered that, so hopefully you guys will enjoy those videos. And if you guys want to co-op with me in Forza, let me know as well. Night day. I did not realize on the rear view mirror there. It says night day. Have not noticed that before. All right, anyways, let's get back into closer to town. Uh, I've got a 187 sure. hostage or homicide investigation. Roger that dispatch. I'm heading north on Panorama Drive. I'm about a quarter mile from the location gonna get up here and yep yeah. all right dispatch we're almost there looks like it's at the gas station never mind the gas station is down that where are you going don't hit me don't hit me i'm a cop keep going man i'm with the sheriff's department go drive or i'm gonna pull you over what was that guy freaking doing okay i'm gonna go okay so they're at the rundown motel Okay. It looks like we got an officer on scene. I'm gonna pull up here. I'm gonna get my sidearm out. Let's get around this way. Officer, you good? Hey guys, what's going on? I'm with the sheriff's department. Right, I'm gonna holster my weapon. Alright everybody, just stand still. I'm gonna speak with the officer first and then I'll interview all of you. Uh, you may not always find sufficient evidence to arrest pursue a suspect. Okay. Hey, man, how's it going? Finally, some backup. Cause of death appears to be a fatal gunshot. The damn coroner is stuck in traffic as usual. Question the witnesses. I'll keep the scene secure. Hey, ma'am, how's it going? I'm with the sheriff's department. Uh, can you describe what you saw? It was that other cop. He's dirty. Oh, okay. That's some strong accusations. Uh, you hang in there for a moment. I'm gonna go speak with these other people. Hey, ma'am, did you see what happened? 
I've seen the other guy around here lurking, selling drugs. Okay. Uh, it sounds like she's talking about that cop. Uh, hey, did you see what happened, man? Oh, shit. Now how am I going to get my 20 bucks back? Okay, so that's not good. She owed him 20 bucks. Possibly he did it to get the money, but that did not make any sense. So we'll talk to this guy as well. I've seen the other guy around here selling drugs before. Okay, that's not good. Um, I'm going to talk to the officer, see what's going on. Can you describe what you saw? I'm not going back in. Whoa, okay, dude. Get on the ground right now, sir. Officer, stop right there. I need you to stop. Dispatch, I'm in pursuit of another officer. Looks like he's dirty. He's trying to run from the crime scene. He just told me he's not going back in. Uh, possibly uh, impersonating an officer. Get on the ground right now, man. Sir, get on the ground right now. Uh, I'm going to switch to my taser. Sir, taser, taser, taser. Got him. Get on the ground and watch your hands, man. Get on the ground and watch your hands. Okay, you know what? I'm not going to be able to cuff him because he's an officer, technically. So it's not letting me uh, actually stop him. But I'll, I'll try again, but let's see. Taste him again. Taste him again. Yeah, so it's not letting me actually cuff him or anything. So we're just going to stop it right there and be like, okay, we caught him. As you clearly saw, we did stop him. But because it was an officer, it wouldn't technically let me arrest him. Even though technically he was the suspect. He did admit that he's not going back to jail. So uh, we're going to have to do a big investigation on that guy. But let's get back to our car now. All right, guys. So I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. Have a great day, guys, and see you next time. And be sure to hit that little bell icon on the channel. That way you stay notified when the videos do go up. Take it easy, guys.